You're going to want to talk to the sheriff in Manta Fe. Phew! What a fun ride! Well, let's get in line and ride it again! Gilly can save the woods with this stuff. The only thing I make out of jelly is jelly sandwiches. Patrick, Cassandra knows what she's doing. If she says bringing her jelly will help get our friends back, then bring her jelly we shall. SpongeBob, what do you see? Water? Soda? Is soda water? What do you see? Barnacles, it's so small! We'll never fit in there! Why do we have to be so big? No, oh, it's not small, Patrick. It's not? It's just very, very far away. We're safe, Patrick! It's Mrs. Puff! If anyone knows where Mr. Krabs is, it's her! She probably doesn't know us here, even though she knows us back home. Here we have to get to know her first. Just like we got to know her the first time she got to know us back home, you know? No. Put that jelly in my mouth. The Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me. luggage doing in the middle of the desert? I think it dropped from Mrs. Puff's carriage.
feel like I've had several near-death experiences on this ranch before. Yeah, it's the Wild West for you. Whoa, is that Mrs. Puff? What's she doing on a ranch? Mm, I love ranch. strangers you came here by foot that's awfully dangerous you could dry out in a heartbeat I get puffy just thinking about it I get puffy after eating stale food hi my name's SpongeBob and this balloon is Patrick we're looking for our friend mr. Krabs but he might not be called mr. Krabs he could be traveling under a different name oh like Jeremy or Petunia or Captain Claus or Ronaldo. A crab without a name, huh? Try Manta Fay. It's where everyone without something ends up. Could you give us a ride there? This is a riding school, not a taxi service. <laughs> However, if you take my test, you could get there yourself with your own riding license. My very own license? Whenever you're ready, meet me by the seahorse. We'll see if you can stay on it all the way to Manta Fe. Uh, Mrs. Puff, I mean, teacher lady, uh, I need to confess that uh, I've been through this sort of thing before, and uh, I'm not always the best test taker, so, uh, so any chance we can skip this part? Oh, nonsense, SpongeBob. <laughs> a little rodeo never hurt anyone who survived it. Ready, set, and go! No! SpongeBob, jump! I like it because it's... Well done, SpongeBob. You scored 35.7 points. Go around! Phew. That was a close one. Keep on smashing! SpongeBob, look out! I've never seen a fish like this. You have six points. <laughs> Out of seven. <laughs> Only one point away from passing. Yay! Oh, can we repeat the test? It was so much fun. Oh, no, that's not necessary. I, I didn't know you had fun. Fun is worth an extra point. <laughs> Here's your license. Thanks, partner. Oh, license. <laughs> She can. This license only allows me to ride seahorses and seahorse like animals, with the exception of. Uh, this doesn't say anything about boatmobiles. Well, once boatmobiles have been invented, I'll just have to take the test again. Manta Fay, my floating friend. My butt is killing me from all that riding you had to do. <laughs> Order up. Champ might be at the saloon if you're still looking for him. The sheriff. Now look what the snail 
all dragged in. You may be yellow as mustard, but you got the bite. Oh, don't bite. Too unsanitary. I'm looking for my friend, Mr. Krabs. Have you seen him? He's got big, beautiful eye stalks and tiny little legs. I'm off duty for the dole, sweetie, but hey, if you can take me, I might look into your case. Yo, Ann, better get yourself a straw partner and make sure it sips straight. We're gonna have ourselves a nice little cactus soda showdown. There ain't a sea critter alive that can drink more soda than me. You're going down faster than a baby at nap time. Jelly Bandit! Sticky sweet. Sheriff, Deputy SpongeBob. And Balloon Deputy Patrick. Are on the case. These jelly thugs got no backbone. Don't let them hurt me. I'm an ugly crier. Did you get the cactus juice from the Cactine Hills yet? I ain't afraid of these bandits. I'm just a conformist. Hey, cutie pie. Care for a tune about the red-handed bandit? The red-handed bandit? Do tell! Oh, the cactus juice and Manta Bay made every day feel sunny. Till an outlaw came a-riding through to make a little money. That vile, twisted, tight-fisted, red-handed bandit. He robbed us of our juice and left our barrels dry. That vile, twisted, tight-fisted, money-grubbing, land-loving, red-handed bandit. This red-handed bandit sounds like one bad dude. Don't worry, lady. We'll find more cactus juice and bring it back to Manta Fe. Hey, cutie pie. Care for a tune about the cactus juice heroes? Well, they sound like a pair of noble adventurers. Yeah, and they sound handsome, too. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so excited. Our very own song. Oh, the cactus juice heroes save the day. Something, something, man to pay. Hey, that's it. Oh, kind of short. Thank you. 
machine. Ouch! Hey, that was my hiding barrel! They're not even pretty. They're just green, juicy, and thorny. L like a cucumber that hurts your mouth when you eat it. Don't worry, Patrick. We'll be out of here as soon as we find more cactus juice. Uh-oh. Looks like it wants to duel. familiar looking gentleman can point us in the right direction. Howdy, sir. I'm SpongeBob SquarePants. Have we met before? Hey, cowboy. Uh, sorry, uh, you don't ring any bells. But I couldn't help but overhear you talking about entering the cactus beverage business. That demands a strong spine. I suggest hiring a consultant to guide you. For a wee share of, um, 70%? I'll tell you where to find the cacti with the most refreshing sap. Folks pay insane amounts of money for them since the shortage. 70%? That sounds a bit fishy. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say 70? I meant, um, 80. Of course. Now we're talking. Just keep going till you reach them cactine hills. And don't ye scam your hard-working consultant. I'm only taking 90% of the business. Come on, Patrick. Let's find those thorny cucumbers. <laughs> <laughs> 